Jack. Oh, I've been so worried about you. I heard you were gone, and I, I feared the worst. You look thin. Have you been eating? You come on inside. Come on. You want some minister of me? I know what's happened, Jackie. And you know how much I've always loved you. You know how I hate it when our family turns against each other like this. Aunt Sarah, I lost her. And what the hell am I gonna do without Jenny? It's terrible. I cleaned out her apartment. She was waiting for you, Jackie. Anyone but you could see it. Oh, you should have taken her away from this place when you had the chance. And now you've got to take care of it. I'm really sorry for the way things came out, Aunt Sarah. Now, you know that I never meant any disrespect to you and the family. But I'm going to have to take a stand against Paulie and Eddie Schrote and punish them for what they did. I know. And some of the older men, they'll support your decision, Jackie. But you're gonna have to earn their trust. If you were to hurt Polly's operation, they might consider joining you. They want things back the way they used to be. I'm gonna tear his face off, Aunt Sarah. Part of my language. But I'm gonna rip that dirty little motherfucker's face off and feed his lips to the fucking rats! But I can't kill that little fucking scumbag without your blessing. You know that. Well, kill is such a dirty word. But do what you have to do. And understand that you won't get to Paulie unless you go through his police dog first. The only way to Paulie is through Captain Eddie Schrote. Now, I happen to know he has an apartment up by Gun Hill. And I spoke to Jimmy the Grape, and he's arranged for a man named Abe Hunter to let you into the building. And I suggest you go there and take up Jimmy's offer of help while you can. <laughs> Everything to live for and nothing to gain. I got nothing worth having without you. But at least I got a purpose. And that's tearing Eddie Schrote into a thousand pieces. It's my reason to live. Police got pity pajamas, don't they? Now, what about them? What happened is the cops brought him in, they took him down in the basement to do a kind of impromptu QA with him. You know what I'm saying? Playing 20 questions. The problem with Pete is this he's weak. He's real weak. You give him some fucking Indian burns and he'll squeal like a stuffed pig. But Pete, he knows stuff. Jackie, we need to shut that little piece of shit up. You know what I'm saying? What well, he's bound to tell those cops is gonna leak down to Paulie, and if that happens, whoa, that's bad for all of us. All right. Where are they keeping him? Yeah, but that's the problem. We don't know where the fuck he is. We got a door number, and that's it. You 
gotta keep your eye open for door 261, you hear me? Chinatown, you're not here anymore. I'm trying to remember you, but all I get is this stupid shit. Like your wallpaper, smelling your hallway. Even my mind is fighting me. Check out this kitchen. <laughs> 